There seems to be an update on the Loyalty Store Alliance Potion debacle. We're going to have a look into that one. Input improvements could be coming this month. The month of April. That's not an April Fool's. Doom's SP3 it does no, no damage in uh, this content. Again, that's not an April Fool's. And Act 7.4.6 Superior Kang might be broken. We investigate. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the Friday edition of the Marvel Contest of Champions News Show. Welcome to Deadpool's Head. Now, rounding you in sound. Okay. Yes, very good. Also, I do plan not to do any April Fool's jokes because, well, there's some serious stuff we have to go over. On I the... guess that makes sense. But let me ask you this. Would I look good in a pink suit? Uh, I think you could pull it off. We've got a... Not surprised by that answer. Anyways, how often do you pummel the pizza dough? You know, place the pepperoni. How often do you order pizza? <laughs> Ow, God, he hit me then. Also, make sure to hit the like button and the subscribe button and all those things. It does help out the channel. Please support the channel. And thank you to those that support the channel as well. As a patron and as a YouTube member, you're on screen right now. Appreciate you very much. Also, those support on twitch.tv slash richthemanlive. Going to do some live streaming later on today. So if you've got an Amazon Prime account uh, or an Amazon, yeah, if you've got an Amazon Prime account, give a free Twitch sub to myself. That would be massively helpful. A thank you. Also, um, yeah, um, those who give tier 1 subs, bits, donations, tier 2 subs, I'll see you later on for a live stream and all that things. But now, we must go over some news. Kicking off with uh, Doom's SP, SP3 not doing any damage. So, this player first of all came and said that uh, the SP3 was doing no damage. And this was in 7.4.2. Uh, so, what the heck's going on with that? That's weird. I personally can't remember what I did with Act 7.4.2. I did recently 100% that, but I cannot remember for the life of me whether or not there was a problem with it. Definitely feel like I used it, especially with on this, Turtling, Static Defense, Arcane Zeal, kind of points to, and Power Shield, uh, points to uh, that you would do damage. Now, sometimes with Power Shield, I'm always like, I never throw the SP3 because I always think that it's not going to do any damage based on some recent kind of interactions. And I kind of think that the more that I, I remember that, the more that that's not correct. Because as it says here, the defender takes 90% reduced damage from all sources except special attacks. While performing a special attack, uh, the attack gains blah, 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 blah. Now, I believe there is another type of um, either power shield or kind of node like this where SP SP3s will cast no damage, where SP1s and SP2s will and do more substantial. Can't remember off the top of my head. Someone could put in the comment section what that node is, but I think people would probably be aware of what that uh, is that I'm referring to. Uh, Fit Fun says, I remember I had this too. Unfortunately, it was three weeks ago, even though it was... Two weeks ago, this content was... As you know, it's only like one week and a bit the content's been out. My God, people have 100%ed it and it's like, yes. Uh, many people. Um, so yeah, this is something that's probably being looked into. I know Kabam Zibit did ask like where these kind of like nodes and things were happening. But it's definitely a bit annoying when your champions aren't able to throw SP3s, in particular Doctor Doom. But I definitely didn't resort to doing any kind of like sp 3 throwing and just stuck to an SP2. So if you are going to do... Anything that has this, or we've got Power Shield that, and you want to use Doctor Doom for it, and many other champions as well, and you don't have to throw an SP3, don't throw the SP3, throw the SP2 or SP1, just because. And I know it will upset the rotation of a champion, uh, regardless if it's Doom or anybody, but it's just best to be uh, safe than sorry when it comes to like actually doing any kind of damage um, on... Uh, on the uh, Defender Champions. And now, input system. Now, as a lot of you know, uh, currently uh, I'm reviewing the Input Refractor, uh, which is meant to be like the in new input system improvements. I'm still thinking about doing a video on it because there's still a lot of kind of like fine tuning that needs to be done with it. And there's a lot of things that still since last year, last June, when was the last, when the last time was that it actually functioned well enough. I'm still finding issues when it comes to the inputs of putting in a secondary input straight after the first. So if you go dex, dex, I'm finding that when you do the swipe and the second swipe, it doesn't engage it for the device. Or the second point to this point is that if you uh, swipe left 
and go into a block, so swipe thumb down or swipe tab, uh, it, it doesn't engage. And that's a problem because that's the same issues that were kind of causing frustration for a lot of players, uh, you know, that time, July last year. But there is some good news in any case. Kabam uh, Mike, in response to a player, said, uh, we're still planning to do it uh, next month. So, you know, it was in March, so April. But haven't set a date for that yet. So, uh, chose to leave it out of the release notes for now. Some more details to come when we have dates. And now on to Superior Kang is broken. Yes, something that's been kind of like a problematic thing. As a lot of you know, like within uh, one week, uh, people have, uh, less than a week, people have been smashing through Act uh, 7, and uh, that's great at the end of the day. Um, I mean, as you know, uh, for myself, it's all about like a race to get uh, 10,000 units in a very short space of time. Can it be done? I have targets. It's going relatively well. I just have to re reach 7,000 units or more on... Um, on Monday and uh, things are going well. If I haven't reached that, then things are going on the back burner. I need to ramp up my game, sadly, but that's uh, that's life. In any case, back to the serious thing, and that is Superior Kang Act 7.4.6. What the hell's going on with this? Well, I think it can be fully and, uh, you know, visually displayed by my good friend, this. Now, there is a big thread on this one, which I'll go over in a second and see some responses from Kabam on the subject and whether or not, you know, compensation is going to come uh, players way because this is actually like a 100% valid reason to get compensation. So as Fist says here, just completed, uh, sc screwed over, was in phase three, got him wounded and completely obliterated his health, was transitioning into phase four, then the screen went completely black for 10 seconds, pause menu, came up, so I tried to resume the fight. Still a black screen except a for a small flickering circle in the bottom left corner of the screen. We started the game, it gave me the chance to resume the fight while loading, Kang was now at full health and still in phase three. Had to redo the whole phase again. Damn, that's really annoying. And to give you a visual idea of what it looked like, it looked like this. Look at that. <laughs> just like a beacon, just like a, I don't know, like a signal beacon, just gonna go boop, boop, boop. It's Morse code, that's what happened. See, what, what Fist didn't realize is that Kang was trying to communicate with him in Morse code. Dot dash, dot dot dash, dot dash, dot 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 dash, dot dash, which translates to, hey, we got a bug here, kabam, we got a big problem, we need help, send help, we need Mike, now, or maybe it was an April Fools, who really knows what that one, uh, yeah, but now there's a forum thread that has been open on this particular subject, and look, it, it is, it is kind of like, it's serious, because it's seriously annoying. Look, look at a load of players, the same thing, come back. Oh, Kang fight, and then they had to redo certain certain things uh, with it. Uh, lots of people experiencing the same thing. Same kind of little kind of like uh, um, beacon glimmer to the bottom left-hand corner. Look at that beacon glimmer. I don't know if this is, oh no, I was going to say, is this Android? Because like, uh, that's an Android phone there. Having some issues here, iPhone 11. So that's something to point out. Someone's got video, I and mean, we've seen the video of how that works. Sad times. What else? Someone here, it wasn't um, phase, it was phase two to three, whereas I think Fist was going from three to four. So I don't know, I don't know what it, that, yeah, it must be like unspecific then. It must be at times then, there must be something wrong with the, the fight. Consistency, ladies and gentlemen, consistency. Yeah, March 30th, yeah, Kabam's a bit looking for feedback. Apart from that, everyone, same problem, same problem, same problem. Um, what else? Just that, really. Any update to this? Because that's the most important thing. Update. I'm just about to fully explore this tonight or tomorrow, so I'm I'm glad someone posted this. I'd love to hear an update. Does anyone know how everything's happening? Kabam says, hey there. Thank you to those who have shared details of this issue. The team is looking into this and investigating possible solutions. For those who haven't yet, if you can provide the information requested above, that can help us narrow things down uh, some more as we work towards solution. I think for Kabam it would be like what paths is there something that kind of unlocks or doesn't unlock anything device wise there's it's pointless because people in iOS and Android are having the same issue so that doesn't really help matters unless it's a year in which the phone or kind of device has been released which I find very and highly unlikely um, so yeah uh, I would say we'll keep a look over this for the time being 
And if you are kind of thinking about going in to do a completion, I don't know if, it, don't know if it's going to be too much of an issue or an exploration. Maybe it's the exploration of a certain path. You may want to hold off on that until there's some more information on this uh, because it we just, just don't have any more details. And where's, what, what do they want? The bug report template. Yeah, I, I just think it's got to be the fight um, because the device makes no sense. Wi-Fi. Everybody's Wi-Fi is having a problem with this. Um, that every, no, everyone's on using a Wi-Fi, so it's like you know, I, I don't, it's not the internet. Uh, game mode. It's gonna it's gonna be game mode or quest, not quest path. That's gonna be it. That's you, you, that's the best thing to narrow it down. You you can't say it's anything else because it's like what well, everyone's experiencing it or a volume of players are experiencing it on multitude of devices. So yeah, it's much something to do with the paths or the all the fights bugged or the games bugged. I don't know. It is April 1st. But <laughs> more updates on that one uh, at a later date whenever we have any more info on that subject. And now an update on the loyalty store situation or mainly the Alliance Wars, Alliance Team, Alliance Potion situation. So all of this, as a lot of you know, if you followed the, the channel yesterday, we covered this and went into detail about the extent of what problems the new potion, the new potion system represent so the the potions here i'm turning into that meme a little bit here potion master i need your strongest potions to go into battle my potions are too powerful for you but potion seller i need them i'm going into battle uh if anybody gets that reference you get it if you don't then um well sucks to be you in any case yeah so um this is the potion setup at the moment loyalty store has just gone pff, through the roof because it's more specified to uh, alliance wars and you're like Damn, man. Damn. Because there's so many implications. Yesterday's video, TLDR of it is basically, look, man, you, you would need to increase the loyalty, reduce down the price of the loyalty spent for Alliance Wars potion-based grabbing, or just go back to the old system because it worked. It was fun. We had a good time, didn't we? Especially because Glory seems to be focused on questing, Alliance questing, and loyalty seems to be um, pointed to Alliance Wars-based uh, stuff. So it does pinpoint a problem for players when it comes to what they'll be doing with Alliance War Seasons. Will they be participating? Is this fair? Well, let's have a look at stuff because there's been a response from Kabam and uh, and yeah, it's just, just kind of like an annoying little um, situation when it comes to Alliance uh, Wars and you know, the just general enjoyment and just like feeling that Kabam are listening to the player base at times and putting in stuff that like, why? Why? Like, they did really good with, like, revamping the Glory Store. Glory Store, good. More of that, please. I mean, I would have hoped for something like a level 5 health potion instead. Alliance Alliance um, health potion, that is. And uh, maybe some more level 4 Alliance health potions you could buy. And maybe even, like, a little bump in some, like, revives. Um, Alliance revives that you could pick up. But now those, those days have gone, sadly. Um, any case, Kabam, what are they saying? Crazy Kabam and all that stuff. Kabam MK says, nothing to share yet in response to all of this kind of like um, a situation of potions and the tomfoolery and shenanigans and debacle. But the team has been hard at work coming up with ideas and improving them. Whatever that means. Whatever that means. Big shout out to the uh, comment commenters, uh, commenters here. Yeah, an MC content creator program, whatever, uh, for giving some great constructive feedback. Feedback is just change it back. That's it. All done. Uh, in the meantime, we are pushing a fix for the Alliance Wars potions and loyalty store refreshing every two weeks instead of seven days as we intended. So apparently, like, I didn't really notice this. But to be honest, there's a lot of stuff that you just kind of look at and go, I don't really notice it. Like here, um, seven day rotation for this instead of two weeks. So I was like, okay, whatever. It's still shockingly bad. Yeah, that's, re that's really it. Hopefully there's an update next week sometime. As you said, team's looking to improve them. So good luck, Kabam. Good luck. Thank you for watching this edition of the show, this Friday show, and I'll see you, um, I'll see you very soon. Have a good one. Check out some other content located on screen. There might be another video today um, kind of talking about the April stuff because we've got to move on, talk about April questing and things, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers. Bye-bye.